Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a meet the horses vlog for you all. So this has been hugely requested on TikTok, Instagram and even on YouTube and everyone wants to know the horses and some of them look similar. So today I'm finally getting around to introducing you all to my horses. So I'm going to introduce you to them all. I'm going to tell you a little bit about each one and just show you who's who. So come with me while we just have a little look. So this one's Sonny. I'm going to get him first in a second. He is going to ignore me, of course. <laughs> so moving on. Teddy, hi, baby. And this is Teddy. He's poking his little nose through. You're so cute. Oh, oh, he's saying hi. <laughs> oh my God, I don't know if you just heard that, but that was Blackjack. Billy, hi baby. This is Billy Bob's. You having a little munch? Cutie pie. And then, next, and <laughs> hi handsome. This is everybody's favorite. So he's not up here, he's down here. Hi. <laughs> You're so cute. You good sassy monster. <laughs> So these are the four that are living in at the minute and then we're gonna go and see Artie who's out in the field. It is really windy today so I'm not sure if you're gonna be able to hear me or not. So if not, I'll have to do a voiceover. But anyway, let's get started, shall we? So first up is Sonny. So he's probably my most um, Instagrammed, <laughs> YouTubed, TikTok horse because Look at this face, look how handsome he is. So Sonny is, his full name is Bolson. <laughs> Sonny is 14 years old and his full name is Bolson B. That's his show name. We nicknamed him Sonny because he's really cute. Um, he is bred uh, Dutch warm blood and he is by Sandro Hit Cross Gribaldi. So he's got very, very good bloodlines, but obviously with most Sandro Hit horses, he can be, can be kind of fresh. <laughs> Why are you so cute? Um, he's 17-1, but sometimes he feels bigger when he's been a little bit cheeky. <laughs> um, so on the yard, he is nicknamed Mr. Calamity Jane, because if there's a horse that's gonna hurt themselves, um, get something wrong with them, get an injury, it's going to be sunny. He loves anything to get out of his work. Anything. <laughs> He's kind of spooky but only at other horses. So a pigeon could fly out of the tree and he will not care. Um, a tractor could go across, he will not care. Have another horse spook next to him, he is off rodeo styles. So, Sonny is a little monkey, but he's very good fun. He's also very talented, so we've competed together up to PSG level, and we've done the Junior Europeans together, and we're currently training through some of the Grand Prix movements, but you wouldn't know he's a Grand Prix horse with the way he's trying to bite my shoulder right now. Look at the state of you. You're so cute, man. So Sonny's one of the horses I've had for the longest. I've had him about five, six years now and he's so funny. I, definitely one of my favorites. He's not the most personable to humans even though obviously it looks like he's giving me a lot of attention. If he didn't want a sugar lump right now, he would be ignoring me. So he's not super personable but he is the quirkiest, funniest horse. This horse never fails to make me laugh. He's hilarious. So this is Sonny. So this here is Teddy, his show name is Vitari V or Viter V, I'm not quite sure how to pronounce it but I kind of like Viteri so we're going to go with that. So Teddy is an 18 year old gelding show jumper and he is a Dutch warm blood again and he is by Voltaire Cross Landlord and he is super cute because he is jumping born and bred so he's the first jumping horse i've ever owned i've normally owned dressage i've been purebred dressage all my life until teddy and he is 
an absolute pleasure. He is the sweetest horse. So some would say like, why did you buy an 18 year old horse? And I needed a schoolmaster to show me the ropes that were safe because I wanted to learn how to jump, but I you know, wanted to be careful at the same time. But also um, because I just figured it's nice that he gets a nice, easy, happy life here with us. So once we've had maybe a year of learning and stuff, he's probably gonna retire here and have a really nice, happy life. So you're gonna have a very chill life, Teddy. So Teddy's amazing, like we can hack around the field and he literally doesn't care about anything. A bird flies out the tree, who cares? Um, a bomb goes off, who cares? Teddy is very chill. We call him like the granddad of the group because he keeps all the other horses completely sane. So you're an angel to hack, an absolute angel to jump. He actually is the fittest 18 year old horse I've ever seen in my life. He loves to jump. Um, you're not great at dressage, are you? We're trying to do a little bit of dressage with him to help strengthen his back and keep him going, but he does not like it. He's like, oh, this is boring, mom. So, not a fan of dressage. <laughs> Jack, we'll get to you. <laughs> and um, he, he can bareback, bareback jump. We can do anything on him. He's really cool. He's a very fun horse to have at the yard. His only like quirks is that he can be a little bit head shy. So um, if you come at him really quick, he is a bit like, oh, what's going on? So I think he may have had a harder life, you know, in the past, or he might be getting a bit old, so his eyes might be going a little bit. But honestly, it just took me about 10 minutes to get this head collar on him because it had to be nice and slow and gentle while he's running around the stable. Um, he is normally very good, but I think it's the fur on it that his, his bothers him. So. This horse's quirks are being a bit porky and stopping to eat grass in the middle of whatever we're doing and being a little bit head shy. And other than that, you are a king. <laughs> so, everybody, this is Teddy. So this is Billy. And before I get into talking about Billy, Sonny, the monkey, Sonny's in this stable right here. He has just tried to take a chunk out of Billy's bottom. He also just tried to do it with Teddy when I cut the camera off. How naughty, he just got a really aggressive bite on each bum cheek. So, sorry about that, Bill Mobs. So anyway, this is Billy, and his full show name is Billionaire. And we got him when he was a stallion, but we actually gelded him because he was really naughty. He wasn't a good stallion, he's been an angel ever since, but he's 14 years old. He is a Dutch warm blood, but he is by Blue Horse Romanoff across Donahall, so he's also got beautiful bloodlines. And Billy's so cute. I had him for um, a few years, and then I went to uni, so I couldn't maintain the horses I had. So we gave the ride of him to another girl. Um, that happened for a few years, and then we recently got him back, and we were so happy to have him back because when he first arrived back, he was not looking his best. You know, he had a really sore back, bad spur marks, like just loads of little problems. And we realized that maybe he wasn't enjoying his work as much because he was getting really naughty under saddle, trying to do dressage. So I've kind of relaxed things with Billy and I'm starting to do some bareback work, some jumping, some tackless, and he is proving himself to be a complete angel. Um, excuse me. And it's really funny because Billy's normally the one where I would have thought, you're spooky, you're naughty. And like when we would take him outside, I really don't trust him very much because he spooks anything. A leaf falls off the tree, or we're going. You know, he's very spooky. So when I tried to tackle some bitless stuff on him, I obviously did it indoors so it was more careful. But I was blown away by this horse. He completely surprised me. I thought he was going to be a devil and he was the best behaved. And now, I actually trust this horse more than Sonny, more than Teddy, more than anyone. He is an angel and he's having so much fun at the moment with us. You're very cute. So yeah, his quirks are being a little bit spooky and that's about it. You're a really good boy, aren't you, Bill? So he's actually the yard favourite because he's so lovely to handle, he's very, very rewarding as a horse and we all just love him. So he is a secret yard favourite, is Billy. 
Ah, uh, Sunny, get off, get off. Sunny, get off his bottom. You <laughs> very Sunny was going in around too. He didn't get enough the first time. So yeah, everybody, this is Vin. So this little guy is probably everybody on the planet's favourite little horse. So this is Blackjack. We call him Jack, and he is a mini Shetland. <laughs> he is ten hands. Ten hands. You are so cute. He's also ten years old, and he is a stallion. He has ten babies. Ten. So you are a regular little player. And he is the sassiest little thing on the planet. So he is by New Park Berber across Zoe of Haslan, I think. So I'm not as familiar with mini Shetland sires as I am with normal full-size horses. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to say you're not normal. He's been learning his tricks. So Jack is the life and soul of this yard. He he whinnies all day every day for treats. He, he's trying to chew my food as we speak. He has currently learned some tricks and you know when he scrapes his foot like that that means he wants a treat and he can also rear up so I might show you that in a second. And stop it! So he's funny because he has literally got the most character of any horse on the yard. Stop it, stop it. So we have 17 hand horses that don't even have as much life as this little guy does. Stop it, sassy little monster. He went out in the field with our 18 hand horse, Artie, and he was the boss. In, within two minutes, he bucked and kicked him and ran off playing. So yeah, he's just literally everybody's favorite. A little black jack. You're lovely as well. All right, I'll get you a treat. I'm going. He knew that's what I was doing. You knew you were getting it. Oh, oh we've never had a sugar lump. Hello right there. Ow, don't chew my boo. So I'm gonna see if he'll rear up for us. Come on, Hanson. Daddy. Come on. Come on, up. Oh, you know what to do. Up. <laughs> Close. Up. Jack. Up. So he did literally, ah, don't eat my tripod. So he literally just did it and then decided not to. So we're gonna, we're gonna take him back to his bed. Hang on. Come on, little guy. So we're gonna take Jack back to his bed and then we're gonna go outside and we're gonna see Artie and I'm gonna introduce you to Bacardi, our companion Shetland, who no one's ever met before. Um, I think it's gonna be too windy to speak so I might have to do a voiceover for this one, but I'll, I'll give it a go. So, come on Jackie. Come on little man, in your bed. In you go. Come on, you know where you're going. So I know a few people might be wondering where my big black stallion G is and G is still currently away training in Holland so I am looking at having him back very soon but obviously I can't go and get him until it's safe to do so, until it's safe to travel and until actually we're allowed to travel so um, after the COVID-19 pandemic starts settling down then I think we'll be getting him back but G is um, 17 hands, he's 8 years old, his full name is Guinness B, which I love, I think it's so cute, and he is by West Point Cross Florencio, so he's got beautiful bloodlines, as is a beautiful horse, and he is amazing, he's just huge and talented and powerful, so I'm excited to share some more videos with him soon. Um, the other horse who you might be missing right now is Tico the baby. So I've shown Tico in some of my other videos and he is so cute, but he is currently away to be backed. So he hasn't been ridden yet and he's a little bit fresh and a little bit naughty. So he's off getting backed by a professional. I'm not 
you know, into young horse training like that or backing. So I'm going to leave that one to the pros. Um, he's really cute though. So Tico, his full name is Artorius. So we did name him that because we bought him when he was a foal. And he is only four years old. He is by Quarterback Cross Royal Blend Gelding and he is stunning. He has just the best movement ever, but he is, he is flighty. He's a bit of a live wire. So I'm interested in seeing what he's going to be like in the future. <laughs> also, he's like 17 odd hands. He's massive. So yeah, we'll wait, we'll wait to see him. So I'm going to go and find Artie in the field and show you him now. <laughs> So this is Artie, he is super cute and as you can see he is running over to greet me. Um, you can't actually hear what I'm saying on the video so I'm having to do this voiceover because the wind was crazy. But yeah, this is Artie, his full name is Artorius and we did actually name him that when he was a baby. Um, he's five years old now and he is a gelding. He is a German worm blood or Hanoverian and he is actually 18 hands. You can't really tell on the video, but yeah, 18 hands. He's huge. He's massive. And he is by Ampere Cross Steddinger. And he has very beautiful bloodlines and actually just started walking away from me from this point onwards. So not the friendliest. And as you can see, look at the wind. This was what I was dealing with. Oh, oh God. Oh no. That is not a pretty picture. I think we're going to move on and introduce you to Bacardi the Shetland now. So that is Artie, everybody. Bacardi, hi! So this is Bacardi. He's our little rescue Shetland. He's had a very, very hard life. As you can see, he is wearing a muzzle because he is so fat and he gets laminitis so quickly and he's showing it at the moment. So we've put a muzzle on to try and help him, you know, so he doesn't get affected by it. And he is a very good companion for Artie. They are in separate fields though, because Artie keeps trying to rip the muzzle off his face. So this is little Bacardi. We don't show him a lot because he's got a very bad attitude. He's had a really rough life. Like I said, we did rescue him from a Shetland rescue center and he is, he's very cute, but he's not the friendliest little guy. <laughs> Also next to Jack, he looks ginormous. He looks like a mountain horse or like an Icelandic pony. <laughs> so yeah, these are the boys. I can see you go gorgeous. What are you saying? I just got complete and utterly blown away outside. It is so windy. So I'm not sure if you could hear a word I was saying, but ah. So I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. Um, just a quick insight into all the horses and a little bit about them. These guys are just my life i love them so much so i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please like and subscribe it really means a lot to me and comment anything else you want to see or any questions you have and i'll try my best to get back to you uh, thank you again and i love you guys